listen, I need you, listen, I need everybody to see this video. Send this video to your cousin, your brother, your uncle, your auntie, your mama, your daddy, your little cousin, your first cousin, your second cousin. I need to teach everybody how to comply with the police because people act like they don't know how to comply. Oh, they act like it's so hard. Listen, look at all these tickets I done got in the past. Listen, I haven't got, I haven't got any tickets in a long time, but I am a hoarder, so I keep a lot of my tickets, okay? Listen, one ticket. Never got shot. I was pulled over. Didn't get shot with this ticket. Speeding. Didn't get shot. Didn't get shot. Didn't get shot. Didn't get shot. You know why? Because I learned to comply, okay? Matter of fact, this is one of my first tickets that I got in high school. I was being a little ghetto, you know, being a little ghetto, trying to be a little thug, you know, and I had my music up loud. I had bought some speakers, some loud speakers, and I was just bumping my music. And, and an officer pulled me over, a white officer, okay? He pulled me over for having excessive noise, excessive noise, okay? So he pulled me over. Guess what? I didn't get shot. He said, you know I put you over, right? I said, yes, officer. I, I have my music too loud. That's what I said. I said, officer, yes, I know why you put me over. Okay? Half of y'all want to play dumb games and act like y'all don't know why y'all are pulled over. You know good and well half the time why you've been pulled over. 99% of people know why they've been pulled over. You knew you were speeding. You knew you were going 80 on a 50. Don't act like that. You Come on now. Don't play dumb. Okay? So people want to act like, oh, they didn't do nothing. No, you did something. Listen, I know it's probably a little embarrassing, but I just want to be honest with y'all. Okay? Listen, I got a speeding ticket here. I remember this speeding ticket. Listen, and I'm not going to lie. Okay? I, I was smelling like marijuana when I got pulled over. I don't smoke anymore, but this is when I was smoking that weed trying to be a bad kid, you know, and uh, a, a little bad teenager, and I was driving, speeding. I was going so fast, the officer was going the opposite way. <laughs> he did a 360 to, to pull me over, and he was like, oh, I know what that smell is. And the first thing I thought to myself is, I bet not say what smell, because he going to be like, you know what smell I'm talking about. Get out of the car. <laughs> and I said, officer, <laughs> Yes, I, I know what you're smelling and I'm sorry. I don't, you know, if you have the right to check my car if you want to, because, you know, it's probable cause and I, I understand, you know, officer, I'm sorry I was speeding and sorry that my car is smelling like this. I was smoking, but I don't have any on me. And guess what? He didn't search my car. He didn't do nothing because I was respectable. I complied, gave him my ID. I didn't drive off. Okay. I didn't fight the popo. I didn't fight the police. Y'all just got to stop fighting. I mean, this ticket, listen, I was going 15 miles over. The officer pulled me over and said, um, he, this was in Texas. He got out. Hey, you know why I pulled you over? He was a country bumpkin. I said, you know, and, I, and I'm from the country, so we, we got alone after, you know, he gave me my ticket. <laughs> but I knew I was going 15 over. I was speeding. I was trying to get to work. So he said, you know, I pulled you. I said, yes, officer. I was speeding and I understand. Um, I was trying to get to work and I was speeding. So I shouldn't have been speeding because I could have hurt someone. I could have hurt someone. So if you want to give me a ticket, by all means, I deserve it. And guess what? He said, okay, I'll just give you a ticket. But you know what he did though? Instead of putting 15 over, he put 10 over. He helped me out a little bit. So, because I was respect. Because listen. I, I was complying and being, and I, and I was being a, a respectable young man. That's all you got to do. Respect the police and comply and you won't get shot. Simple as that. I don't see what's hard about that. Look at all these things I got. Oh, I was speeding, 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 speeding. And one time an officer grabbed me. I'm not going to lie. I was in Austin, Texas. I was on 6th Street and I saw a few people drinking, walk, walking around and you know, I was like, well, maybe I'd grab me a little drink, too, and walk around with me a little margarita. And guess what? Before I even opened up my can of margarita, the officer was watching me. As soon as I popped the can open, he grabbed me by my arm like, like I was a little kid and snatched the margarita from me. Okay, I didn't get to sip it. 
and he threw it on the ground, stumped on it, and then he and he gave him on my arm, and he said, "Come with me. I'm right. I'm giving you a ticket." And he was grabbing. He had me by my arm, and I was just like, I knew I was in the wrong, so I wasn't about to fight the officer or say, "Get off of me! What you doing this for?" You know. I just said, "Okay, officer, I will follow you." So then he let me go, and and you know he was a little aggressive, I think, you know. But guess what? I shouldn't have been drinking outside. It was illegal. Of course. That's why he grabbed my arm to snatch the, the can away. Okay? Uh, listen, I didn't try to fight him or nothing. Just give me my ticket. You know, you, you didn't grab me a little bit, but give me my ticket. But he let me go, you know. So, it is what it is.